Hello YouTubers, I'm Parwiz and in this video I'm going to show you that how you can uh, send email uh, to your Gmail accounts using Django. So before this, uh, I highly request from all of you to uh, subscribe to my channel and also like the video. And uh, if you're a beginner, uh, you can watch my complete 4 hours training on Django. I have added the link to the video description. Now, uh, uh, sending emails with Django, it's easy and simple. Uh, First, you will need to have a local SMTP server or define the configuration of an uh, external SMTP server. Uh, so, uh, and we need to do some configuration in our settings.py. And uh, after doing that, we can send email. And also an important issue, because I'm using Gmail, also you need to do some configuration in your Gmail account. Because by default, you cannot send email, for example, from your Django application to the Gmail. Uh, uh, Gmail uh, doesn't allow this. Now, I will show you the configuration. Uh, first of all, uh, I have already created a project. Uh, I call it my project. And also, I have created an app. Uh, so, it's I have called that my app. So, now uh, I have uh, opened my settings.py and I have added the configuration. You can come down and you need to add these configuration here. So, the first one is, let me describe. The first one is the email backend. Uh, this is django.core.email.backends.smtp.email backend. Now, uh, if you don't want to use any SMTP server, you want to test your application, you can use Django console. I will show you that. Uh, you can simply send your email to uh, from your application to the Django console and it will uh, be uh, tested for you. So after this, we have email host user. Now, uh, this is the SMTP server host. By default, it's local host. And uh, I'm just using my email address in here. And this is the email host. Uh, we are using smtp.gmail.com. And this is the port. Uh, and also, we are using uh, email use TLS. And I have made this to true. It's used for whether to use the TLS uh, secure connection or not. And the last one is uh, the our uh, password. So email host password. And I have uh, uh, I haven't added my password in here, but I will add that password in this section. So uh, if you run this, uh, you will receive SMTP authentication error because we need to do some configuration in our Gmail account. Now uh, this is my Gmail account. You need to click on here and click on account and from that place you need to enable less secure apps and you need to click on security and turn on access so you can see it's not recommended uh, one important issue that uh, i am telling if you have a two-step verification for your gmail account you cannot uh, this option will not be available so you need to click on this and after that this page will open and you can see a warning some apps and device use less secure sign-in technology which makes your account vulnerable you can turn off access for these apps which we recommend or uh, turn it on if you want to use them despite the risks so Google will automatically turn this setting off if it's not being used so by default it's up off and you need to on this so like this and now uh, it's updating okay now it's updated uh, after updating this, now I'm going to just op just open my uh, terminal in here, and uh, I want to do this uh, uh, send email through terminal. Uh, now let me just bring it in here. Okay, so in here. Uh, okay, now before this, let me just add uh, my password. Okay, the first thing I need, I need to change directory to my project. And in here, I'm going to use python manage.py shell because I'm using Django shell for this. Uh, okay, now I'm waiting for the uh, Django shell. And it, okay, now the first thing we need, we need to import from django.core.mail. Uh, we are going to import send mail like this and after this now we are going to use send underscore mail and now in here the first thing you need you need to add the title so it is uh, Django test mail I'm going to call it 
and after this this is the body and you can add uh, this is a Django uh, test body uh, also uh, you need to add uh, the email in here so like this make sure that you don't uh, miss a spell because uh, if you do that you will receive error and now let me just add my account in here also and uh, the last one that we are going to add that is uh, fail silently uh, it's because we are telling uh, to Django uh, to write an exception if the email could, couldn't be sent correctly now you can just simply write fail uh, silently and make this to false like this okay so we have error in here misspelling not error okay fail silently now let me just run this and hopefully it work okay guys so in the first time I have received error because there was internet connection now uh, you can see if your output is one it means that uh, you, uh, there, uh, the sending of email was successful now let me just uh, check uh, my uh, uh, a gmail that uh, I have this email or not okay guys now this is my gmail account and you can see that I have a Django test mail so this is the mail that uh, we have sent and this is the body this is Django test body that uh, we have added in here this is uh, uh, Django test body and this is Django test mail the title so like this you can send uh, email from Django to your Gmail account now uh, if you want to if you want to don't use Gmail or any SMTP server I have said that you can use a uh, Django uh, backend console now let me just uh, show you that that how you can use that okay now let me just uh, uh, comment this like this and uh, okay let me just copy in here and uh, now you can see that we are checking that uh, if it is not in the back we are going to do this and in the else case we are going to use django.core.mail.backend.console.email backend and now if you uh, for example uh, do uh, send your email again now let me just uh, uh, do the do this again and if I send this uh, you will see that uh, I'm receiving the email uh, in the console so now email sent successfully and uh, I think it is uh, sending let me just check okay now I have created a new session let me just uh, run this again and uh, let me run it and you can see this is one and we have uh, received our email in here and in the console you can see that this is uh, the email from to uh, from to and this is the subject uh, like this uh, you can uh, use a uh, uh, you can send email uh, so thank you guys if you have any question please let me know and for the further videos please subscribe to my channel like the video and also share the video